In this sum, length is 90, height is 60, and width is 60. And what they have given? They have given 90 on the left side of the O. So what we will do? We will write O. And we will take 90 on this side, 60 on the other side, and height is also 60. First we will draw box. After drawing this length width height box, we will start with front view. Now in this sum, this is part 1, this is part 2. Now I am not sure which one is nearer to me. Same way if I see over here, then I have three surfaces x, y and z. So now I need to find out which one is nearer to the observer, which one I should start first. So let's take one part 2. Let's say if I'm assuming part 2 which is nearer to the observer and if I draw part 2 then what will happen? If I'm drawing part 2 then if I see side view then I see questions side view then I see side view then over here when I see it's a full line and over here if I, if I see in front view it's partition see that you can see from here right if you see in this there is no line over here but if i draw part 2 nearer to the observer then there has to be one line so what i'm thinking that i am not too sure with the part 2 still if i'll go ahead with it then part 2 would be something like this right whatever is there in the front the same thing is behind right but if i see side view see this it's straight so that means this is not matching in fact this part is matching in the other part that 40 right the part which has where dimension is 40 where there it is matching so we need to come to a conclusion over here that which part is nearer to the observer one or two i have already tried part two but you have seen that it is not gelling well with the side view so what we need to do, we need to take part 1. So I am not taking part 2. I will take part 1. So first I will draw part 1. Now if you see the diagram, see part 1 is there that I have drawn. With that part 1 I have this x part. How much I have to go inside? 20. So if I'll go 20 behind, I will get part x, right? So I got this part x. Now after that, now if I'll start part 2, which is there in front view, so that how much I have to come ahead? 30. And then go down, then again go outside, again come down and join this. So now what I have drawn is part 2. And now if I see side view, I have to just draw this behind, take this point behind. So I'm getting side view also part Y and Z. So once again I will just explain it to you. If you see the main diagram, this part one, it's here. Then if you see part two, see this, which is behind. How much behind? 20 behind. So that is part 2 then if you see side view you have x that is here then you have y so you have to go behind you have to go behind by how much 40 same way here also you go behind by 40 you get y and z and this entire block will be done